Yo, check it out. Boom Bap Art back again with new video. Today I'm going to show you how I upgraded my MacBook Pro uh, mid-2012. Yeah, but first I want to check the cheapest MacBook Pro available 2019. Um, let's see on their website. Um, doo -doo -doo. 13 inch MacBook Pro, 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of SSD hard drive. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna put 16 gigs in my mid 2012 and 500 gigs of SSD storage. And I also wanna check machine system requirements. Uh, let's see, uh, Mac OS 10, 12, 10, 13, 10, 14, latest update. Uh, Intel Core i5 and uh, four gigs of RAM and some additional requirements USB 2.0 um, 9 gigs disk space and uh, let's see uh, 33 gigs for complete 12 select yeah yeah enough with the rambling let's dive into the video now let's go yes here's my MacBook Pro mid 2012 and uh, I've had it for like years now been going slow as how you know uh, let's check the startup or the boot time um, as it is right now as you can see 2 minutes 54 seconds that's pretty damn slow so let's unscrew these three different screws uh, but yeah keep track of them because they're different uh, one is shouldered one is not and one is longer when that is done remove the bottom case and if necessary vacuum clean the fan or the components very gently and uh, the next step is to remove the hard drive bracket uh, that holds the, the hard drive in place um, uh, only two screws that holding it down and um, yeah and uh, as you can see you have a little tab uh, just pull and um, the disc should come right off and uh, remove the hard drive cable uh, and uh, put the disc aside now uh, take your new fancy fancy hard drive uh, mine is a samsung 500 gig ssd drive uh, and yeah remove the old pull tab from the old drive and save it but that's optional but uh, for easy access yeah uh, remove the, the four screws from the sides um, and now screw them back on to to your new drive um, and um, connect the hard drive cable and uh, now it's time to put the disc back in place but first if you want that easy access attach the pull tab um, yeah and um, now put the disc back in place and yes you're done almost just screw the hard drive bracket back on uh, these two screws now on to the memory slots pull the two tabs on the sides and remove the RAM sticks uh, the first one is pretty easy to remove uh, the lower one can be a bit tricky so um, yeah be gentle and now now take your new 16 gigs of RAM and start with the bottom one yeah of course um, and make sure you put them in a slightly angled position and uh, yeah make sure they are connected all the way 
and um, here's the second one uh, and the upper one uh, that's the easiest one and yeah boom 16 gigs of RAM 500 gigs of SSD storage yes yes now it's time to screw the bottom case back on uh, just put it back in place fits snugly and uh, yeah take the screws um, one is shouldered one is not and yeah and yes and just tighten up the screws um, not too hard and um, you're done It's time. Don't forget this step before you remove your old drive uh, to make make a bootable drive uh, with the operating system on it. Um, as you can see here, I have my bootable drive. I hold the Alt or the Option key for a very long time. Bada beam, bada boom. Uh, formatting the my new SSD drive. Installing Mac OS. Uh, yes, I'm from Sweden and um, let's see, uh, no, 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 um, I don't want Siri, hell no, um, let's see, kaboom, and we're in, 16 gigs of RAM, and the new SSD drive and this is not sped up this is real time so um, so um, yeah twenty one twenty two twenty three I mean come on twenty five seconds that's that's a freaking improvement right so with that said before you go out and trash your old macbook pro and buy a new one for thirteen hundred dollars i i would rather go and pick up new pieces of ram and a new hard drive and uh, yeah and you're good to go for at least a few more years I just want to say thank you for watching. I hope you liked this one. I hope this video was helpful. And new to this channel, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. Leave a thumbs up if you like it. Comment down below. And yeah, see you soon in my next video. Boom.